What's cracking YouTube? So today we're gonna do a little Chick-fil-A review because we're only doing this review because it's basically gonna be Chick-fil-A versus Canes. We're gonna see which one is better, but we'll do the comparison in another video. But for this one, we'll just start off with the review. So to really compare, you know what I'm saying? I was about to just get a chicken sandwich, but I got the strips just cause, you know, Canes, you know what I'm saying? They're known for the chicken strips. So that's basically what we're gonna decide and decipher which one is better. So it's about 1130. So let's eat this before I go into work. And then when I get off work tonight, I'll probably go to Canes and then do the Canes review. And then we'll see, we'll see which one is better. But let's get into it. So we have never been to Chick-fil-A, you know what I'm saying? You get waffle fries with your meal. This is what a waffle fry looks like if you've never seen it, you know what I'm saying? All right. The waffle fries, nice and hot, they're on point. Nice little bit of salt to them. So, the fries, you know what I'm saying? They down there get, you get it like an 8.5 out of 10. You know what I'm saying? Pretty good. So, these with the chicken strips are looking like, you know what I'm saying? Small, small size strips, you know? Not really big at all. I'm saying a little decent size one right here, but still kind of small. They got all kinds of sauces at Chick-fil-A, but I just stick with the ranch because I don't like to do too much. So, we're going to see what it's hitting for. Give y'all this little taste test real quick. You know what I'm saying? Got a chicken strip. Got a ranch. I'm going to get a nice little dip. Yeah, they chicken strips. It's got a nice little flavor to it. You know, it's not, it's not like, it's not too crunchy. You know what I'm saying? I don't got like a big ass crunch or nothing like that. Oh, you can tell there's a little bit of crunch to it, but it's not like, you know what I'm saying? I know Cane's, they got crunch in their chicken, but we'll get into that later. But as of late, you know what I'm saying? This is this is all right. This is all right so far. We'll see. So scratch that. I won't be going to Canes tonight. After work, I gotta go to my other job. That's the complete opposite way from my house. So we'll get the Canes review in when we get it in. I just thought about that shit just now. Not bad, you know what I'm saying? Let's try it with the ranch. Yeah, still an 8.5 out of 10. You can eat these with or without the ranch, honestly. But chicken strips. We'll give the chicken strips an 8 out of 10. Yeah, I get these an 8 out of 10, bro. Because this is a solid meal, bro. You can, it's, not, it's not bad, bro. 
But let's talk about the price. So four count chicken strip meal. I think this is a, what is this, a small fry? I don't know, medium fry. And then medium lemonade. Total was $12.99 plus tax, $1.14. So my total was $14.13. So basically $15 for this meal. Um, realistically, this should be like no more than $10 after tax. So pay $15 for this is crazy. Depending on what state you're in, you know what I'm saying? Some people don't even make aren't even making the bare minimum of fifteen dollars an hour, so it's like for this meal to be that much, that's that's insane. That is truly insane. Realistically, this shit should be like six or seven dollars. And then people would, you know what I'm saying? They'd like it more. So now that now that we're talking about the price and shit, we gotta bring down the overall rating just for the overall experience. So we're going from an eight down to like eh, six point five. Chick-fil-A gets a 6.5 6.5 out of 10 for the overall experience of the four count chicken strip meal whenever I do the, the Canes review I'm going to get the Caniac combo and we're going to have to talk about that price for sure so the rating who knows what the rating will be it depends on how they bring out my meal so I'm sure it better be top tier A1 otherwise it's gonna be a problem when I drop that rating but yeah this is this is gonna get a 6.5 out of 10 I would have just said 6 but you know what I'm saying they do have pretty good customer service here at Chick-fil-A so that's really why they got that 0.5 but for the price $15 for four little tenders chicken tenders you know what I'm saying? That's that's insane. Truly fucking insane. It is. Well, I'm gonna eat the shit because I'll pay for it. But let me turn these windshield wipers up. But yeah, that's what it is. Let's hit this lemonade. do got fresh squeezed lemonade in that motherfucker so the lemonade will give it we'll give the lemonade uh i'm not gonna lie bro get the lemonade a nine out of ten the lemonade is fire but overall rating experience is still a 6.5 some good ass lemonade though Alright, that's the review. I'm going to catch y'all on the next video.